slide in. Thank you for helping us out with that so that people can come in on the ends if they come in late. Um, thank you so much for being here and for supporting. I hope you found some amazing things out there. I, I'm just really, I hope that we get some fun guest conductors. Um, the kids have been plotting what they're going to do to embarrass me. I can't wait. So thank you so much for coming and supporting the auction and all of us and for being here for your students tonight. I just want to remind you to please turn off anything that might make noise. We are live streaming and recording tonight, so we want to keep the sounds that we have practiced as the only sounds in the room. Um, oh, there's one other thing I need to say. It's fine. Um, we are, I am so, so, so excited for this first piece. Um, Mitchell Atencio is one of our instrumental teachers, and he uh, took this piece, it's called Lullaby by Daniel Elder, and he arranged it for orchestra and choir, and approached me and said, oh my gosh, can we do this thing? And I said, yes. So we performed it with the orchestra at their concert on Tuesday, and they have been generous enough to come and join us here for our concert tonight. And um, it's a little bit, it's just really exciting. I'm just gonna walk over there and pick up the baton, and there's so many, look at them all. So this is a little bit of a dream come true for me, and I wanna thank Mr. Atencio, give him a huge thank you for arranging the piece and preparing the orchestra and giving us this moment. Thank you so much.
Hey, concert choir, did that work out? Are we okay? <laughs> Nobody ever has to know, right? In the fall, we had a, an assignment where all the students got to research some choir music, think about songs that they might want to sing, and suggest songs for their choir. And then I went through and selected some that I thought were really great choices, and those were presented to the class, and the class members got to vote and pick one of the songs. So every song that every choir that you'll hear tonight is singing one song that a student found and was voted on to be performed. So this next one is the one for Convivo that they voted on. And I hesitated just this much uh, to let them, uh, to put it forth as an option because we are going to end with Jingle Bells and this is Jingle Bells, but they're very, very different. So don't worry, you're not going to get overridden by all the same.
Christmas Just like the ones I used to know Where the treetops glisten And children listen to hear Sleigh bells in the snow Snow So then I, I, I am dreaming Christmas with every Christmas card I write. May your days, may your days, may your days be merry and bright. And may all your Christmases be white.
Every December we always remember to celebrate the fella in the suit. We see the promos for reindeer and his glow nose. Believe me, I think Rudolph's nose is cute. Set chamber. These guys have worked really, 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 really hard. Man, I ask a lot of them. Um, we've, they've got about, I think, 10 or 12 songs that they learned so that we can go out and perform in the community. And if you want to hear all of them, which you do, um, Saturday night, this Saturday night, we are performing our full show. We call it Coco and Carols in the Commons. Tickets are $5 to help us cover. We've got some treats and some hot chocolate. It'll be a really good time. The other thing that I ask of these guys is they put together some solos in small groups, and um, they're stellar this year. You really, you don't want to miss them. So if you need something to do Saturday night, come on down to the Commons. So tonight you're getting just a sampling of what they've worked on.
several that they sing. I'm just going to let them do their thing and get out of their way. Um, we have White Winter Hymnal, which is always a favorite. And um, I, they teach themselves this thing that's going to be happening there. I don't even know how to do it. Another teacher contacted me and said, hey, we want to do White Winter Hymnal. How do you teach your kids the body percussion? And I went, <laughs> I send them to YouTube. <laughs> and they learn it on their own because it's 2023 and they're young and I'm old. Anyway, um, <laughs> so we'll do that. And then the second one is, or the next one, excuse me, is a piece that's near and dear to my heart because it's a song that I sang when I was in high school. Um, and so instead of the Carol of Good King Wenceslas, it's the Carol of Good King Kong. And then finally, we will finish with a twist on a traditional. We all know the 12 days of Christmas and the birds upon birds upon birds. And maybe you've thought to yourself, I wonder what I would do if someone gave me that many birds. What would I do? So it, we're going we're gonna to tell you that story. It will be the 12 days after Christmas. F sharp. Somebody go p play an F sharp. Thanks, Santiago. <laughs> Good King Kong looked up on his nose and he 
else have to set up. But I can, I got stuff. Thank you so much for being here and all the support. And particularly for those of you that bid on auction items. Um, this is the first time we've done it for the whole choir program. The first time we've really been raising money for something for the choir program as a whole. And um, my expectations for tonight was like, whatever, I hope it's great. Whatever it is is great. Um, before I announce the winners, I wanna give the giantest thank you to um, Andrea Lutz who headed this silent auction and everyone that brought things and everyone that came to help her, but particularly her for taking this mastermind when I was overwhelmed and she said, I got this and she did, it's amazing. Thank you, Andrea, yay. Um, you guys, I'm blown away. The total um, amount raised was over $1,900. Ah, I know! So exciting. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That gets us a huge step towards getting some more risers and shell, and in a minute when we do jingle bells, you'll see why. They're everywhere, we love them. So I'm gonna announce the winners, and I'll try to be very clear in my diction. And afterward, um, after the concert, if you are a winner, you need to go out, and Andrea is set up kind of somewhere in the hall in this middle back part by the um, display cases so as not to be in the flow of traffic this way. Um, please go see her and pay tonight and pick up your items. Um, if you uh, won one of the, something that's like a certificate that's one of mine, you can take that certificate, but I have the names so I know who those are going to. Um, we've got, we can do cash check or card, um, pay tonight, pick up your things. And again, thank you so, so much for your support of the choir program in so many ways, particularly right now um, in helping us get this new equipment. Okay, so here we go. Avery Miller won the spa basket. And let's not clap every time, even though I'm going to say it in a way that might elicit like, yay, we're so excited. Avery Miller, spa basket. Kaylin Gray, the PR aesthetics skin care, um, William Lutz, the original Christmas art, Dave Bevan, the self-care and help basket, Kaylin Gray, the family game night, thanks Kaylin, James Gregory, the Oakley sunglasses, uh, Nancy Wild, the joint basket, Nikki Henstrom, the Bath and Body Works basket, Adele Lamb, the Nut Garden Basket. Barry Garden Hire, the Handmade Quilt. Dan Schmatz, the Beervana Restaurant Gift Card. Adele Lamb, the Kids Gift Basket. It says pink in parentheses. I don't know what that means. Alyssa Taylor, the Popcorn Maker. Nikki Henstrom, the Kids Gift Basket. Blue. Kaylin Gray, the handmade earrings. Student made those, by the way, so cute. Dave Bevan, the waffle basket. Linda Sarine, the dance kit. Lisa, oh, these are the ones that I did. <clears throat> Our guest bell player will be Liesl Bailey, or whoever Liesl Bailey decides will be the guest bell player. Um, the guest artist goes to Jasmine Washington or whoever she decides is gonna do that for them. They get the rights. The guest conductor, um, Whit Evans. The song selection goes to Adele Lamb. The opportunity to embarrass Miss Thorne, I'm afraid, I will tell you, um, goes to Riley Hamada. So a huge round of applause and thank you to everyone who bid and our winners in particular. Make sure you pick up your items before you leave tonight. Thank you, here comes Bell Choir.
So it's time for the big finish. So um, we're going to finish with Jingle Bells, which we've done. This will be the 11th year to finish our, to close our Christmas concert. So um, start coming up, kiddos, in the order that you're supposed to. And then if we have any alums, graduates, um, see these beautiful Christmas trees? There's going to be space in front of and beside them for you guys to come stand and sing. And then you'll be right on stage when it's done, so make sure you come and say hello. So if we have any graduates, former Corner Canyon Choir peeps, please make your way up onto the stage. Yep, you guys keep coming across. Give them just a minute, and then there'll be lots of space for you. All right, my stage people, come on up now. I think we are in place. Oh, my, look how many graduates there are. I can't even handle it. My little heart, she is bursting. Remember, just remember your choir skills and like, you know, tall in the tall places and short in the short places and windows. We know how to do the things. Okay. Um, thank you once again for sharing your evening with us. We, I so, so, so appreciate um, the magic that is being part of this community here at Corner Canyon in particularly in the music department and the choir program. You guys, I just feel so grateful and lucky. Thank you for being here. Thank you to all of these beautiful humans. We hope you have a wonderful, wonderful holiday season.
Lexi, a huge thank you because the holidays are so busy and she just spends so much time just like teaching us music and we just love her so much. Thank, thank you. you.